And welcome back to Need for Speed Heat. And today we have the Ferrari Testa Rosa Coupe 1984, which is a beautiful year since it's my birth year. And this video has been brought to you by Jeffrey Mills. He requested this to be done for him, so thank him, guys. And if anyone else out there has a request they want to do, just throw it in the comments and I will most certainly do it for you. But let's get right on into it today. I'm going to give you guys a live tuning. And there we are. This is what I'm rocking for now. Nothing too crazy. But the main important things are the motor, so let's get right on into that. First motor is going to be the 4.0 V8 with 985 horsepower. And what are we going to get down the drag strip here? I'm just running track tires, track suspension, nothing fancy. Coming off the first drag from a dead stop at 212. And what are we going to come once the car actually gets moving? 271 kilometers, which is not too bad out of the box. I tell you that right now. I've done these things quite often, and that's actually pretty good for the first motor. And let's get right on to it. This is a 4.9 flat 12 with 1,100 horsepower. And what are we going to get down the dead stop drag? Oh, 226. Very nice. Coming around the corner, down the long stretch. What are we going to get? 282 kilometers. That's actually very nice. 2.9 V6, 905 horsepower. Seems we're downgrading here. I'm not going to be uh, too shocked at this thing's feeling pretty slow, guys. Not going to lie. And we're going to get a 204. That's extremely slow. What are we going to get once this thing actually gets rolling here? Is it going to make a difference? 250. Awfully slow. I think I've done that with a stock Honda motor. Let's get into something a little bit better. The 6.2 V8 1239 horsepower. Absolutely gorgeous engine. And what are we going to get from the dead stop down the stretch here? 230 kilometers. Very quick. Holy hell. Coming around the corner there at 282. Holy Jesus. That's a fast car right there. I like that motor. That might be in the top three. We'll see. 4.5 V8 with 1,083 horsepower. What are we going to get from the dead stop? 220 kilometers. Not too bad. Once she gets moving around the corner down the long stretch. And 285 kilometers. Very fast. Not too bad. But kind of slow for the start. But very fast. Once it gets moving. 5.2 V12. 1,200 horsepower. What are we going to get down the stretch here? 220. 28 kilometers an hour coming around the corner down the long stretch. What are we gonna get? 282 K's very nice guys next motor for 8.4 V10 to 1200 horsepower What are we gonna get down from the dead stop? 229 kilometers very nice only one kilometer faster than the last motor, but very nice indeed. What are we going to get after the long corner there? 287, very fast. 3.9 V8, 1200 horsepower. One of my favorite motors out there, guys. This thing is an extremely fast motor. 232, fastest dead stop pull so far. Coming around the corner there, 296. Holy shit. That will has been the fastest so far. Holy 6.5 V12, 1239 horsepower. Very last motor of the batch. What are we gonna get from the dead stop? Coming down from the last one here. Holy, feeling pretty quick, but not as quick as the last. 223. Damn, almost uh, 10 kilometers shy is the last one coming around the corner 282 holy not too bad let's move on to the top three guys top three 3.1 3 3.9 v8 1200 horsepower number one number two 8.4 v10 1200 horsepower gorgeous motor and then the last is going to be the 6.2 v8 1239 horsepower i thank you all for very much for watching if you guys have any quests let me know but other than that, I hope you enjoyed it. Please share, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.